So I ask the Deputy Prime Minister, can he guarantee that the Prime Minister never asked anyone to urge the security services to revise, reconsider or withdraw their assessment of Lord Lebedev of Hampton and Siberia? Deputy Prime Minister. The, the suggestion she's making is sheer nonsense. But if she wants to talk about national security, then I remind her that she and her shadow cabinet colleagues not so long ago wanted the Honourable Member for Islington North. Mr Speaker, a man who wanted and talked about abolishing the army, pulling out of Trident, she voted for that. Has there ever been a more ridiculous, reckless, naive moment to call for unilateral nuclear disarmament and pulling out of NATO? Labour, uh, a Labour government would put at risk our security. We do everything we can to protect it. Thank you, uh, Mr Speaker. I was, uh, wanted just to point out, and I hope it's not uh, ancient history, that the Prime Minister was, as Foreign Secretary, galvanising the response to the nerve agent attack uh, in Salisbury at the time where the Honourable Member, the former leader of the Labour Party, uh, was, was siding with Putin against the UK. What did the Honourable Lady have to say on Sky News? He's a very strong leader. She can't wait for him to become Prime Minister. Yeah.